Today we're going to talk about mass versus weight. Mass is the physical property that measures the amount of matter in an object. Weight is the amount of gravitational pull on an object. We'll start with mass. I have here a triple beam balance. We use this tool in science to measure the mass of an object. If I want to find the mass of this stapler, I simply place it on the pedestal. And then what I can do is I can start to slide the gram counters to try to balance out the arm to zero. These, these, this is the single gram counter uh, beam. On the back we have, it counts by tens. And as you can see, it's more than 100 grams there. And then the middle beam, we have the gram counter that counts by 100s. So I'm going to go ahead and shift it to 100 grams. Nothing happens. Switch it to 200 grams. Nothing happens. Switch it to 300 grams. Nothing happens. 400 grams. Nothing happens. And 500 grams, the arm tips too far the other way. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to back the gram counter to 400. And then I'm going to go back to counting by tens. 10 grams, 20 grams, 30 grams, 40 grams, 50 grams, 60 grams, 70 grams is too far. So I'm going to back it up to 60 grams. And then I'll go back up to the very first where I or the very first beam where I started, which is the single grams. So I have one gram, two grams, three grams. And at this point, it's very, it's, it's getting closer to the zero. So I'm probably not going to go all the way to four. There's three and a half. And three and a half looks like maybe just a little too much. So I'm going to back it off a tenth of a gram. And so according to my triple beam balance now, the mass of the stapler is 400 grams plus 60 grams is 460 grams plus 3 grams is 463 grams and four-tenths of a gram. So the, the mass of the stapler is 463 and four-tenth grams. So if I'd like to find the weight of this stapler that I used to measure the mass of earlier, I have to use a different tool. I use a spring scale. Now what I do is I attach the spring scale to the stapler and I hold the handle at the other end. The spring is compressed or pushed down together, and I can read the amount of force. Now, weight is measured in, or is based on the amount of gravitational force on an object, and so force is measured in newtons. In this case, the weight of this stapler measured in newtons is four and a half newtons a force pulling down on this stapler. Weight, however, since it's based on the amount of gravity pulling on an object, if I take the weight of this stapler on Earth, and then I go on up to the moon, and I take the weight of the stapler on the moon, I'm going to get two different numbers. Because the amount of gravity pulling on this stapler on Earth is greater than the amount of gravity pulling on this stapler if I were on the moon. 